A mastopexy is the plastic surgery term for a breast lift. People may seek to have a mastopexy after losing weight, they may have changes to the breast after pregnancy, or may just have developed breasts that haven't got much support and have a degree of droop to them. And of course, ageing changes will contribute to any of the previous mentioned factors. So a mastopexy can lift the breast, lift the nipple, reduce and tighten that skin envelope, as we tend to call it, and reshape the breast. A mastopexy operation tends to be done under a general anaesthetic or at least with sedation and involves um, a scar that goes around the areola, vertically down and sometimes into the crease itself and that will depend on your skin, the degree of lift that you're, that's needed and a few other qualities that I'll be able to decide on examination. It's often a day case or an overnight stay in hospital and it is something that has a relatively quick recovery from, albeit after taking and following the post-operative instructions very carefully. Recovery from a mastopexy is best thought about in a six week block. For the first two weeks, you need to take it really easy, not do too much, no, no heavy lifting, and really look after the surgical sites. At six weeks, you should be able to go back and do most things you'd like to, going swimming, uh, proper exercise. And between that two week and that six week block, you can gradually build things up, but don't overdo it, because if you overdo it, that can cause problems in itself and the scars really need that six weeks to maintain or regain the strength of normal skin to withstand the rigors of heavy lifting and exercise. Risks specific to mastopexy include wound healing concerns, particularly at any T-junction, junction of, for example, the transverse and the vertical scar, which can be a bit of a nuisance if they happen, but usually aren't that significant. The most significant but fortunately very rare risk is death of the nipple. If the blood supply is damaged as the nipple is lifted up, particularly if it's lifted a long way, that is a risk that we've always got to bear in mind. And other risks that are associated with the operation, such as bleeding, infection, problematic scarring, are also associated with mastopexy. There can be some differences between breasts, as there are in every one in any case, and if those differences are significant afterwards, it might require revision surgery, and there are some other risks that don't happen very often, such as fluid buildup needing to be drained off and something called fat necrosis, which is when the blood supply to the fat has been reduced and may require antibiotics or even um, a surgical washout, but that's fortunately very unusual too.